Being a contractor in the corporate world, what are some of my options to grow my wealth? So I really like this because a lot of the time we're talking about business owners and we're talking about growing your wealth through through business. I guess being a contractor, you sort of are in business for yourself, um, but you're, you're billing an hourly rate, right? So um, this this particular client, he really understands that uh, when you're billing for an hourly rate, you can't grow an asset out of that, you can't build wealth out of that. However, you can generate uh, really good cash flow from doing that, uh, substantial cash flow in some circumstances. So with that being the case, you're a contractor, you're working for an hourly rate, you're making really good money. What you have to do to grow your wealth, you have to make sure you've got a surplus income, right? So it doesn't matter how big your salary is or how much you're earning, you need to make sure that you're spending less than you earn and that you're saving money each month. And then with those savings, with that surplus, they have to be invested into growth assets, right? So typically when we talk about growth assets, we're talking about real estate and we're talking about shares or many funds. And those are the two asset classes that you can you can passively or actively invest in um, and it will outperform inflation over the long term. In the short term, they'll go up and down, they're gonna be volatile. But if you wanna grow your wealth, there's been uh, so many countless amounts of, of millionaires and billionaires who have made their money uh, investing in these sorts of assets and it's no different from anyone else. If you're a contractor, you're in the corporate world, get that high paying salary and invest it into good assets. Do that over 40 and 50 years, you'll end up a multi-million.